Hey guys, Mr. Gregory here again. I'm down in the dungeon with my water heater down in the basement where it's nice and quiet. It's Monday morning. Sorry I didn't create a more interesting video for you today. I was hoping to get outside yesterday. It was gorgeous. Uh, I was going to have Vivian help me film some beautiful outside shots, but we just didn't get to it. So uh, I hope you enjoyed some rest this weekend and some time with family. I just wanted to say a couple things about the lesson today. I think the three main questions today may be the most important questions yet, so really take some time with these. The question about what it is, the first question for today is really important, so spend some time thinking about what it is. There's another question about the lie. What is the lie? Really want you to think about that. And then also the character Garrison seems like a really minor character, but he's actually really important and central to the whole story. So really spend some time thinking about Garrison and his role in the story. I wanted to say a couple other things today. Something new you're going to do is read some analysis from your peers. I selected some of the best answers from Friday, and let me tell you, some of these answers were so good. The analysis was so deep. And sophisticated and interesting it literally gave me the chills reading it so when, when that happened I would copy and paste it so to the right of the topics page you're gonna see a really long list of a bunch of great answers from lots of different students on Friday please skim through that read as many of those as you can and respond to one of them that's really the kind of level of analysis we're looking for and I bet you'll learn something that you didn't think of by reading some of your peers' analysis. And I'm calling it on-fire analysis because when I read that, I just thought, wow, you are on fire right now. You are really getting it. And I was getting the chills uh, reading it. So really impressed with some of your reading. I need to comment on some of your habits, though. Ray J, I've been noticing that has been doing his answers at 1.20 in the morning. But then today, I noticed Zale did his at 12.54. He's already done his lesson for today. He did it at 12.54 a.m., last night and they don't become available till 12 so I guess he was waiting for it and then conquest 240 a.m. what are you guys doing up at 240 a.m. doing your homework anyway whatever as long as you get it done it's up to you but I do hope you're getting some sleep let me see what else do I need to mention here uh, please read your your friends posts and respond to those remember I'm available during office hours please Feel free to, to pop in and ask questions. We are working towards uh, an informal, personal essay that you're going to write about this book. So I do encourage you, if you see good quotes, to start marking them and think, yeah, I'd like to use this. I'd like to incorporate this if I was going to write about this piece. So look for good quotes that you connect with personally and be thinking about how this work connects to your life personally. Just looking to see if there's anything else I want to mention. I think that is it. So again, really impressed with your analysis. Hang in there. Uh, keep plugging away. And please let me know if there's anything I can do to help. Hope you guys have a great day. See you.